live wire so Wi-Fi battle against you guys the viewers subscribers supporters and lovers of having your gym and eating it too because today <laughs> today we are starting things off with our uh, I forgot the region what's the what's the black and white region called uh, <laughs> well don't I look stupid anyways the gym leaders that uh, our team is going to be today is uh, Chili Crest and Ceilings team uh, I don't even know if that's how you say his name uh, but anyways it's gonna be a single battle not like a triple or some crazy like that um, but it is an interesting team just because I had to figure out how to make uh, oh and we're going up against Brandon from Instagram before his name goes away um, it, it was interesting making uh, a team based off of that uh, so yeah we'll see what he's bringing and I'll let you know what I'm bringing <laughs> so he is bringing oh dang a Galvantula wait what I was like, did I just see a Chimchar? Yes, I did. So he's bringing Charizard, Galvantula, Needle King, Mr. Mime, Registeel, and Chimchar. I gotta admit, this is like one of the weirdest teams I've ever seen. But I love that. I would love to use this team. I don't know what the hell the Chimchar is about, but it's scaring me. And uh, we are bringing... We are bringing uh, Ferrothorn, Semi-Sage, Darmanitan, Semi-Seer, Slowking, and Semi-Poor. Uh, so, of course, Galvantula being a thing with a sticky web, and I am not okay with that. So, what do what do I have? Do I have anything? Uh, nope. Alright. Um, Alright, I have a Darmanitan. That's my only hope. I'm gonna start off with Darmanitan. Wait! Never mind, it's not gonna work, because I'm Life Orb and Sheer Force. I was gonna say I can flinch it, and then we'll be good to go. But you know what? I think I'm just gonna have to lead off with Ferrothorn, get the Stealth Rocks up, and all that good stuff. Uh, help out with Charizard and Chimchar if he's trying to do any kind of uh, Focus Sash shenanigans with Endeavors and Quick Attacks. That might be one of those Pokemon. Uh, so we'll see what happens here. So we, of course, does start with the Galvantula. There's nothing I can do about getting the uh, sticky web up, so we just kind of have to, we just kind of got to let that happen, but we will get our Stealth Rocks up in exchange, so uh, worth, I think so, uh, and next turn I can go for Leech Seed, <clears throat> might have been better off going for Leech Seed first, but doesn't matter, doesn't matter, because then that would have been a turn of... That would have been smarter. I'm gonna do that next time. Keep that in mind. Leech seed first. Leech seed first, kids. Word of advice. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for leech seed. I could go for gyro ball, but oh, he actually volt switches, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we'll take that just fine, and we'll see who he wants to go out into. And they'll get leech seeded. So if they're here to stay, they won't be staying for very long. <laughs> Am I right? All right, let's see. Uh, Needle King is definitely a thing he can go out to. He can also go out to Charizard if he really wants to. Um, which, if that's the case, he's going to have to force me to make some switches up in this piece. Uh, so he does go on to Chimchar. So that's interesting. We'll get to see what he's trying to do here. Uh, I do have Protect, so I can kind of get a turn of, like, scouting. See what's up there. <laughs> I don't know what I just did. Um... So we'll we'll probably have to probably have to make that happen. Let's see. Uh, so I'm gonna go for protect and see see what this little guy is up to here. It would be nice to actually use this turn to be able to switch, but I really I kind of okay. So he's just going straight for the overheat. So he's just a crazy attacking chimchar. I can respect that. All right. But who better to go out to to take a uh, overheat than my man Slowking? Am I right? Hopefully. I mean, I know I could take an overheat, but I'm I'm still keeping an eye on you, Chimchar, with your uh, with your uh, endeavor shenanigans. I'm not gonna forget about that. So we got caught in the sticky web, but they don't call me the king of slow for nothing. I am okay with that. And. Uh, Nice. Nice, clean, 
eating it up damage from uh, overheat. And we get more health thanks to Leech Seed. Nice. Alright, so Slow King, I honestly gotta say, is kind of a problem for his team. Um, I honestly might go for Future Sight, because I have that. And he's gonna withdraw, which is cool. I don't mind him withdrawing, just because that's more damage from uh, Stealth Rocks that he'll have to keep taking. And I really don't know what Registeel wants to do to me. Uh, he could get up Stealth Rocks, that's the thing too, but I don't have anyone that's as weak to Stealth Rocks as... Uh, Pokemon like it's Charizard. I only have two fire Pokemon, so everyone else will just kind of be uh, brushing it off. Uh, so we have Future Sight. We also have Fire Blast, so I think I'm going to click on that. So Registeel is faster than me, thanks to the sticky web, so that's something to keep uh, keep in mind. And we're going to go for Fire Blast and not miss like a pro. Hey! I love that sound of super effective damage, and that did nothing at all. So maybe we'll maybe we'll get an actual fire Pokemon out here. Actually, I think I want to just fire off some Scalds because burning this thing would be nice. Oh no, Toxic! Okay, that's not gonna work out so well. All right, so I'm gonna see if I could burn. If not, Slow King, you're getting out of here. And we're gonna bring uh, my Future Sight. That actually was not bad. That did some damage. Um, I might go for Future Sight again, because that'll be nice to hit, like, a potential Charizard coming out later. And the Poison won't do too much to me. I have Regenerator, too, so I'll be getting my health back. And honestly, I don't even think this Registeel can touch me. He's actually going to go for Amnesia. Um, I don't know how much that matters. It might matter, because he has Leftovers. And all I really wanted to do was just... Uh, was just get Leech Seed up on him. So I got the Future Sight going, so I'm gonna get up out of here and I'm gonna go out into Ferrothorn. I could take him out right now, but I don't know what he's trying to do still. Uh, he only has one attacking move then, apparently, because he has Amnesia, Stealth Rock, Toxic, and I wanna assume Earthquake. Which actually that sucks then because uh, Ferrothorn can't get hit by that. Alright, so let's see who this is. So he's going to go out into Mr. Mime. That's fun. Um, we do have the future site ready to do something at some point. So now we get Ferrothorn going out here. Um, I don't really think Mr. Mime has anything to hit us too hard with. Also, Mr. Mime is a fairy type now. And we have Gyro Ball. And our speed just got lowered. Let's go. I'm just going to click uh, Pharaoh Ball. <laughs> I'm just going to click Gyro Ball. And, uh, Mr. Mime, you are not going to be appreciating this, I can tell you. Actually, I think if he goes out into Charizard right now, it will die, which is hilarious. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what happens here. So it's actually going to withdraw, which is cool because I get a free hit on something. And he actually goes out into Registeel, which I'm pretty sure is going to die too, because Gyro Ball, Stealth Rock, and Future Sight... Altogether has got to mean something. Ba bam! There we go. Don't forget about that future side, boy. All right, so Red Steel is gonna go down. Not bad. That was wasn't really a threat. I mean, I had Fire Pokemon, but I wasn't trying to have every member of my team get poisoned either. So that's pretty cool that we got that out of the way. Uh, so Charizard, Nido King, Chimchar. A million and one things that uh, Ferrothorn does not really want to deal with right now. But, we have switches. We have switches. That's all we're worried about. So, he is going to go out into Chimchar now. I don't know if he's going to go for Overheat, to be honest. I'm going to go for Protect again, because I don't trust this monkey. I don't trust it one bit. We'll see what happens. He actually goes for Grass Knot. Predicting, see, I knew I should have attacked, honestly. Predicting my Slow King to come out. Um, and so, you know what? I think I'm going to make a safe switch here. He could still have Endeavor, which is bad. Yeah, I can't go out into Darmanitan now. Um, dang, what was I thinking when I made this set? I have a Simiseer. 
that I could switch into, but its only attacking moves are Focus Blast and Fire Blast. It's like I'm asking to miss all of my attacks. But hey, let's go out into semis here. That could take Overheat, that could take a Grass Knot, and you know, whatever, whatever else. We got some monkey v monkey battles going on right here. Figure out which monkey is going to come out on top. So he goes for Grass Knot again. Dang it. Should have gone for, uh, should have gone for that, uh, that gyro ball. But hey, that's okay. We're still sitting pretty. And, uh, I'm going to go for Substitute. Sub Nasty Plot Simisir? I think so. That actually kind of does a lot. It's concerning. It's very concerning. Alright, so we're going to get the Substitute up. <clears throat> we're going to get some HP back. And all will be uh, right in the world. And I'm going to go for Nasty Plot. The thing is, I won't be on speeding anything anytime soon, so... That kind of defeats the purpose of sweeping. But, I'll get some uh, nice and powerful special attack going on. Substitute shouldn't break. Should be good to go. I think next turn it'll break, which is kind of sad, but hey, we tried. I might go for substitute next turn, to be honest. Just to ensure that I'm behind the sub. Because killing it now won't do much for me. It should break my sub, right? Grass Knot? Break? It, it was kind of doing a lot. There we go. Got it. Got it. Alright. So we're going to be behind the substitute now. <clears throat> Not having too much HP, but we will guarantee that after we take down Chimchar, the next Pokemon will get to get a free hit on it. And that's, that's what I wanted. So, uh... Focus Blast. Get your focus on and don't miss. Right in the middle of that Chimchar's face is it's where you're aiming for. It's actually going to withdraw, which is pretty cool, because now we have subs up for even longer. And this thing just dies to a Fire Blast. Maybe even a Focus Blast. We're plus two. Come on now. And we hit it, which is amazing. So this thing might just be going down. Yeah, there we go. Later, Galvantula. Alright, so now we still have a fresh new sub uh, right here. So we're looking we're looking pretty comfy. It's going to take them a bit now to get around that. At least one shot. So that's pretty cool. The thing is he's faster, so the turn after he breaks it, we're for sure going to go down. Does Mr. Mime get Infiltrator? I feel like it does. I know it gets... Uh technician which is weird but I'm gonna go for a fire blast here and uh, see what happens oh man I guess we'll find out now if he has infiltrator he does not okay cool good to know so substitute is gonna fade but that's okay because we can get this fire blast off and this thing might just die and we don't miss we get the stab we're plus two I'm sorry mr. mime you gotta die right now all right not bad not bad Alright, so now Simisir's at that point where pretty sure pretty sure it's gonna die. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Turn what? <laughs> that Brandon, uh, let me take a moment to say you have some great nicknames on your Pokemon. I have never seen an arrow used in a nickname uh, in in such a majestic way as you have right now. So we're going to go for a uh, Fire Blast, just because, hey, why not? It's actually a Charizard X, so that's kind of scary. Um, especially because now, Fire Blast won't do crap. But he's going to go for Earthquake, so it doesn't matter. So Charizard X, you say. Mm hmm. Alright, so we definitely have some things for this. Um... I kind of want to use Ferrothorn though. He's only at half HP, so a Flare Blitz plus, like, uh, what's it called? Plus my Iron Barbs at full health should do a pretty decent amount. Um, and everything I kind of needed Ferrothorn for is gone. All he's got left really is Nido King, so I'm going to go out into Ferrothorn now and see if we can uh, get some crazy damage going on right here. 
I'm just gonna go for Gyro Ball, cause why not? Charizard is definitely a lot faster than me. And actually, I think uh, Chimchar dies after this. So it actually goes for Dragon Dance, which is awesome, because now he's going to be even faster. So this thing might just die to Gyro Ball. Like, he's got to be way faster than me right now. So he doesn't die, but I don't... I mean, he could have Roost. That would be a thing. That's not okay. Um, I'm actually going to go for Leech Seed in case he decides to Roost right here. So it goes for Flare Blitz, which is what I was hoping for, which means he's dead. Iron Barbs plus the recoil from a Ferrothorn at full health. You are not lasting too long, my friend. So Charizard X is going to be taken down. I actually had a Rocky helmet. I didn't even realize that. So yeah, that's how you beat a Charizard. If you, uh, in case you were wondering, use a Ferrothorn. Take it from me, New Age Steel. I would know. I would know what Steel Pokemon beat Charizard. <laughs> Ferrothorn is the number one. <laughs> Alright, so here, um, all he's really got left is, like, Nido King. I'm gonna go out into Darmanitan, though, because he does still have Chimchar, but I'm pretty sure that just dies to South Rock. So, it's gonna be Nido King versus the rest of my team. And, actually, never mind, Darmanitan won't speed, uh, Nido King. So, Nido King actually might just kill me. Didn't, kind of forgot about the Sticky Web. But, you know... We we took that took down that uh, chimp charge just now, so worked. Plan officially worked. All right, so Nido King, still an issue. I know the ferocity of Nido King, and actually, if he has Thunderbolt, we might lose right now. If he has Thunderbolt, we're pretty much dead. So let's hope he doesn't. So there's the bulldoze that's probably gonna take us out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is he a physical Nido King? It's interesting. Um, I'm gonna go out into Semi Sage right here because that would allow me to see uh, what other moves he might have. I have Knock Off on Semi Sage, so that might be cool. He does have an item on his Nido King, probably a Life Orb. So let's uh, let's let's get that item out of here. Let's let's take care of that item. Um, I'm doing this because it'll show me if he is physical or not. Because just because he has Bulldoze doesn't mean he doesn't have special moves. But because he has Bulldoze, I feel like he might not have Thunderbolt. So I'm kind of just using Semi Sage to see if he's going to go for Sludge Bomb or not. Because if he has it, that's the time to go for it. Or Ice Beam. But uh, if he doesn't have anything to take us out, we get the, we get the knockoff going. So kind of... We have Pokemon to spare right now to feel it out. Basically, my plan is to beat this thing with Slow King, if I can. But it all depends on what moves he's got. And yeah, there you go. <laughs> Semi Sage is one of my favorite of the uh, of the uh, Simis. So he goes for Bulldoze again. Uh oh. That might have been bad then. Oh no. No 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 no. Ah, oh, he was Joy Scarfed. No! That's what I was afraid of. Aw, oh, dang. Now he can use other moves. I might have just helped him win. <laughs> and I'm Joy Scarfed. What the hell? I guess I gotta go for knockoff then. Uh, damage. Okay, so he is physical then. He is physical. Okay, okay. Then we should be good. I don't think he's got Thunderbolt. Okay, 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 okay. I was gonna go out and slow king now. Should be good to go. And this thing will uh, be taken care of. And we did have all of our health back thanks to Regenerator. And now we just go for Scald. As long as he doesn't have Thunderbolt, which I don't think he does now at this point. Oh, yes! And we're good! <laughs> There you go. Wait. Yeah, Thunder Punch was what I should have been afraid of, but Thunder Punch isn't as strong. So, that, that definitely would have worked out better. Alright. We did it! Not bad. Not bad. A good game, Brandon. 
Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and share the video too because I love it when you guys do that for me. And it helps out the channel a lot and shows me just how much you guys enjoyed the video. And also, if you would like to have a chance to battle against me and have your videos put on my channel, go ahead and follow me on Instagram or Twitter where you ask for battles and then I respond and then we get together and I say, hey, do you want some chili, some psyllin or some cress? And then you say, I don't know. And then I say, here's all three of them. But not really, because this is just some random mosh of a triple battle team. And then we have a single battle anyways. So, if you'd like to be a part of that, that's all you gotta do. So, until next time, guys. I'm New Age Steel. Keep on watching. And I will see y'all later. Bye-bye.